No matter what news you consume, today it's likely filled with stories of swine flu. But what is it? And what do West Hartford residents need to know? It's the flu. It's not necessarily anything life-threatening. And so for most cases, uh, the usual rest fluids and uh, Tylenol is, is, is the best thing. Swine flu is a new strain of influenza. There's no vaccine for it, and swab testing is the only way to know if you have it. Dr. Wolf says, treat this flu like any other. Stay away from sick people. Use antiviral wipes, and of course, wash your hands. Stephen Hewlett, director of health in the West Hartford Bloomfield District, says citizens shouldn't be alarmed, but aware. So it's not a function of if, it's certainly a, a when. It, it will be easily hours, days, and we'll have a positive case in Connecticut. West Hartford's two-step pandemic plan is already in action. The first step is to educate the public, schools, and town officials. Hewlett says this process has already started. The second step is community mitigation. This would happen after an outbreak in West Hartford and would include closing schools, theaters, and other public gathering spots. If you have flu symptoms, there are a few do's and don'ts. Rushing to the hospital if you don't need to be seen from a medical point of view is going to uh, cripple us if, if, if a lot of people come in and then we can't attend to most of the people that don't have the flu and don't have any other issues like that but are critically ill. And the hardest I think for us, especially in a tough economy, is to say I'm going to stay home from work. But if you're truly sick, that's just what you should do. In Hartford, Anna Stone Street, localonlinenews.tv.